This is a 2004 Saturn with the 2.2 Ecotec engine. And uh, I picked this up for basically parts or scrap price because they had engine problems. And uh, I believe what happened was there was a failure in the timing chain and the pistons got, or the uh, cylinder valves got hit. And as you can see, I've stripped, took the valve cover off, the intake manifold, I've unbolted air compressor, or uh, air conditioning pump, starter, stuff like that. Make it easier to look at the motor. And I removed the engine mount like the manual says to check the timing chain and uh, I got the timing cover off <coughs> and this is what I seen right here I don't know if you can see it how well you can see it but I believe this is part of the timing chain tensioner you can see it's broke That is probably why. That is probably why the timing slip jumped out of time and the uh, valves hit the pistons. You can see right there where it broke, and then up there it's kind of been chewed up by the chain. So. I'll uh, pull the head, I'll finish taking the timing chain off, the gears, all of that will need to be replaced, chain, guides, tensioner, pull the head and see if that's rebuildable with new valves, see if the pistons have been damaged. That's plan A. Plan B is right here. This is another Ecotec engine from a running car, same year, 2004. But it'll need some parts swapped from that, the view engine to this one. The engine mount's different. This one had a mechanical throttle. The view has electronic. Power steering's different. And. Uh, I believe uh, there's some water pump or water line differences here. So that would probably be changed, but hopefully I don't have to go that route. Hopefully I can pull the head, fix the valves, all new timing, uh, timing chain system, and then hopefully I'll be good to go for another 150, 200,000 miles. But uh, this is what it seems that these Ecotec 2.2 engines are known for is timing chain problems. With the uh, the timing guides are plastic, it has a hydraulic timing tensioner on the back. The uh, motor oil pump pressures that tensioner up. But uh, this is my video of a project that I took on that I probably shouldn't have, but I'm knee deep into it now, so I might as well continue. Thanks, and uh, hopefully I'll get it done shortly. Thank you.